July 3rd. We are at Grow Cap. I'm trying to take this shore for a while. Otherwise it's just trails in through the woods and we want to be out here because there's so few times to be on the shore, even though it's a bit challenging as you can see with these boulders. But it could be worse. It could be gravel or little cobbles. Kind of a hazy day, quite warm today. They're expecting highs and possibly the 90s, so that's another reason to be on the shore with the breeze. Kind of a neat picture up here looking at the top of the hill, the cliffs, and the forest. Those wind generators slowly turning, collecting this great breeze and turning it into electricity. We were told today by uh, Mike Landmark that the number of generators that they have here today is enough to power all of Sault Ste. Marie, Canada. Pretty impressive. This is what it looks like here that we're walking in. And there we have our eagle. Look at these rocks. I love the way they're dipped. The geologist in me wants to look at dip and strike. And these are like waves of solid rock. Extraordinary. Resting like that, one after the other, just like the ones we've been on, but the ones we've been on have been very small up till now. Very nice, extremely pleasant to be back on the beach with solid rock again. Just climbed up the hill from the beach shoreline, and here, still on Cape Grow, Cap Grow, excuse me, or Grow Cap. Here's what it looks like to stand beneath one of these giant windmills. And you can hear what they sound like. It's pretty, pretty subtle. I'd much rather see and hear this sound than the sound of hole being dug out of the earth, or oil belching from the ocean depths. And that's where our trail leads, into the woods. A little bit buggy in there. Have anything to say about these? No, I'm just really impressed. It's a neat thing to come on to. Otherworldly, I think, is the only way I can describe it. 